Hi, my name is Jess and I'm with the Discovery Program in Ontario Parks. We'd like to take you on a journey today throughout some of the important wetlands in Ontario Parks. While they're all different, they're all very important. They provide us with carbon storage and they filter our water. But not just that. They also provide us with excellent areas for recreational opportunities, and they provide habitat for wildlife. Please join us as we explore the differences and the similarities in Ontario Parks wetlands. Hi, my name is Kristen from Presque Isle Provincial Park, and I'm in the Discovery Program. And here at Presque Isle, we have a great example of a marsh wetland. So marshes are areas that are underwater most, if not all of the year, and they're dominated by emergent vegetation. So emergent vegetation are plants that are rooted below the water and then they emerge above the water. Here at Presque Isle, the most common plant is the cattails. And marshes are important areas for filtering water and also habitats for lots of different creatures. Hello, I'm Sarah from the Algonquin Provincial Park Discovery Program. Here in Algonquin, we have a great example of a spruce bog and here's why it's unique. Many years ago, this area would have been an open lake or pond with vegetation such as sedges and mosses growing from the edges in towards the center of the body of water. Over many centuries, this mat of vegetation would have grown over the body of water to the point where it would almost cover it up completely. This mat can be so thick in some areas that the black spruce tree is able to grow right on top of the mat. Hi, I'm Kathleen from McGregor Point Provincial Park in the Discovery Program. Here at McGregor Point, we have a wonderful example of a fen wetland. This fen is such a cool habitat, and it's known especially for having a large variety of carnivorous plants, like bladderwort, pitcher plant, and sundew. So even as we're here chatting, the plants around me are busy eating insects like mosquitoes. We're really proud to protect this habitat because it's pretty rare in Southern Ontario. Hi, here we are back at Rondo Provincial Park. At Rondo, we have wetlands called sloughs. Sloughs are giant pockets of water that are found all over this park. They're seasonal, which means that they're at their biggest and deepest in the spring, and by the fall, many of them have dried up. They provide excellent habitat for wildlife like salamanders and frogs to lay their eggs, because there aren't any large fish that you might find in other wetlands. They're also excellent areas for wildlife viewing opportunities. 